Hello everyone, this is Gamer Cat 9 and welcome back to Life is Strange True Colors. We are entering Chapter 3, Episode 3. We are continuing on from where we left off. Jumping right into it. Oh, thanks, sack boy. That's what I wanted. Chapter 3. Monster or Mortal? So, the end of Chapter 2, we found out that Typhon might be lying about something. Yes. Okay. What's happening? You have a superpower? Oh! We told You're her. You're fucking with me, right? Uh, no. Do Ryan and I look like the fucking with you type? It's all true. Fine. Then tell me what I'm feeling right now. You're feeling disbelief. <sighs> hmm. <laughs> You're actually a little annoyed. You feel hurt that we didn't tell you until now. Whether it's true or not, you don't like being left out. Well, okay. <laughs> it's just like, boom, bitch. <laughs> oh, shit. The foosball game. You knew exactly what to do. I mean, not to play the game, but... You needed to focus on the positive memories, not get lost in the sadness. I thought it would help. It did. Just warn me next time, okay? Deal. Never thought I'd have a freaky empath friend. Pretty wild. For now, friend, wink wink. So, any sign of Diane today? No. But she was in yesterday, working on her laptop. You said she was afraid of something around Gabe's death. If she's covering up what Typhon did, I bet there's proof. I hope so. If she comes in today, let's be ready with a plan. In the meantime, I've got to finish my shift. We're on it. I have people to serve, apparently. Time to earn a paycheck. There's I should clean the dirty dishes around the bar. There's a note. Read. Jed, thank you so much for remembering my birthday last week and that Marco Esquanda tequila was excellent. You are welcome over any time. Your best cook by a long shot, Francisco. Okay. I gotta clean up the dishes around the bar. How do I bartend? I don't know how to bartend. What is bartending? Bar I, I never bartended before. How do I bartend? How do I bartend? It's a jogger dirty dishes. Clean. You didn't ask her if she was done. You just took her plate. That's rude. Don't do that. Just be like, ma'am, are you finished? Like, don't just like take her burger. Who the frick just takes burgers? I can't go on a run. Everyone will see how awkward and out of shape I am. Forget it. Been there before. Maybe I can encourage her. <laughs> encourage her by freaking taking away her burger. I don't know. Hey, can I ask you something? I've always felt too self-conscious to try running. You seem like a pro. Any tips? Oh, well, definitely don't let that stop you. Just push through it, you know? I'll try that. Thanks. Did it change? Trust me. You're not alone. Did it work? I guess it worked, okay. And Jed's here. I want to speak to him last. Where are you, girl from Rome? Gosh, I really miss that song. They used to play it in here all the time. Weird. 
I've never heard it. Maybe Jed knows where it went? Mmm, that's why I gotta talk to Jed. Okay. Oh no. If I can get help on my own, Riley never needs to know about my condition. I won't have to be a burden. Oh, don't say my that. Heart that she's coping with this alone. She shouldn't have to. Can I take your dishes? No? Fine. Oh, the bird watcher. In your face, Ryan Lucan. I'm birder of the year, and your reign is finished. Amazing. Uh -oh. Better not tell Ryan I had a hand in that. Nice. You get him, girl. Again, ask people if they're done eating. Don't just take their dishes. I don't like that about waiters. Don't just take people's dishes. Oh god, she's here. No, I wasn't ready. Hey, welcome. I'll be right with you. Totally be awkward about it. I better check in with Stefan Ryan. Yeah, hold on for a sec there because I need to ask about the song. Hey, where do we keep unused jukebox CDs? We don't. Everything we have is in the jukebox. Cool. Just curious. Can I ask her about the song? Yes. Hey, do you guys know a song that goes, Where are you, girl from Rome? Holy shit. Blast from the past. Alabaster Daydreams. Thank you. My dad used to love that song. Gabe would put it on repeat just to mess with him. Okay. Got to the point where he couldn't stand to even hear it anymore. Okay, you could stop talking, Ryan. I so, what happened to it? Eventually, Jed pulled it out of the jukebox and stashed it somewhere. You could ask him. Mmm. Sweet. Thanks. Okay. Alabaster Daydreams. Hey, boss. Do the words alabaster daydreams mean anything to you? Oh, hell. Like brother, like sister, huh? Fine. Guess it's been long enough. It's back behind the bar someplace. Thanks. Okay. Oh, look at that. Right there. I have it. And then use alabaster daydreams. All right. Let's hear this infamous song. Oh, I gotta... There we go. See if she likes it. Alabaster Daydreams! That's it! How the hell? Don't worry about it. Sweet. Okay. Ear taps. Ah. Colorado tap water. <laughs> okay. That's the note we read, dear taps, peanuts. I'm not convinced this is totally sanitary, but what do I know? Oh, that's true. I did do coffee shop work in other games. I forgot about that. I did uh, coffee talk in Valhalla, so I kind of did some bartending, but... The spring festival is nigh. Nigh, I say. <laughs> Haven Springs celebrates tonight. Please join us this evening in Heritage Park for the annual Spring Festival celebration. Complete with food, drink, music, games, and more. No RSVP, RSVP required. I almost just said RSP. <laughs> Not to be a single issue voter or anything, but fuck Typhon. Yes, I agree. Fuck Typhon indeed. Okay, she's there. I can't feel her. Gabe- Oh, G Gabe's plaque. Love you, Gabe. Oh. In memory of Gabe Chen, who came into the spa stranger and left it as family. Oh my god, the feels! Bomber jacket. The hell am I gonna do with a jacket that says hell divers on the back? Jeez, I don't know, boss man. Maybe you could wear it. Like the rest of us are gonna do. 
You think I want to broadcast my affiliation with you jokers to the rest of the world? I got a reputation. Hmm. Interesting. Let's see what we got. Ducky! Hi, my dude! It's gonna be a long night tonight. Always is. Same thing every year. Oh, night's the spring festival. I wonder what's wrong. What's going on, my friend? Hey, Ducky. Is everything okay? Of course. I've never felt better. You're lying. Okay. Glad to hear it. You're, you're lying. You are lying, sir. Poor Amelia. Hmm. We already saw that. I started Dustin Daylight while you were at work. And then we have Charlotte. How is she doing? Hey, getting ready for the big LARP? Oh, hey, yeah, trying. I hope we can get Ethan into it. Oh no. I really do. Is everything okay? Yeah. Don't worry, I'm sure he'll like it. Something's on her mind. I can't read her though. What is this bear doing over here? Jed acts like he's in charge, but we all know who really calls the shots in here. What can we do to help Ducky? I want to help Ducky. Wall of shame. Steph and Ryan, the newest inductees. Mm. Gabe would be proud. Amazing. Caught him. Sleeping. <sighs> I don't even want to read it. I'm so mad at them. Let's speak to him. Did you trade out the quarters in the register yet? All you, kid. Okay. How do I do that? Where is the register? Oh, this is the register. It's not letting me do it, though. The fuck? How am I supposed to properly bartend? Can I go back here? No, fuck, I can't. Hey, Eleanor. How are you? I'm doing okay. Thank you, dear. You're I not- I really appreciate your help from a couple weeks ago. It means a lot to me. I'm glad. Of course. I'm glad I could help. That's what girlfriends are for. Gotta help each other out. We're not getting any younger. I think that's all I could do here? There's really not much else. If I can get help on my own, Riley never needs to know about my condition. I hate that. I won't have to be a burden. Can't feel him. Alright, so I guess we'll just talk to them. <laughs> Steph and Ryan, but mostly Steph. Okay, she's here. Oh, I warp behind the What's bar the now. <laughs> well, we have two plans, actually. But we're still workshopping them. Okay. What does workshopping mean, exactly? It means Ryan won't admit that my plan is perfect. Okay, so here's what I'm thinking. I asked Diane out on a date. Wait, what? And she's so into it. She doesn't notice one Ryan Lucan swiping her laptop. Ryan carries said laptop upstairs, acquiring damning evidence. Maybe Diane and I still hook up? Not important. <laughs> no, that's, that's your plan. That's too risky. You're assuming. Oh my God, please tell me you have something better. I do. Now, to be clear, it's the same plan. Except, <laughs> I'm the distraction. Look, Steph, I don't even think she's gay, all right? She's probably into the rugged mountain man type. 
all the transplants are. What? You're you're just as terrible. <laughs> okay, maybe these plans do need some more time. What? It's a simple plan, literally two steps. N no. You just need to choose the hotter distraction. No. <laughs> okay, I'm not doing that. You're the only tiebreaker we have. No. <sighs> oh, no. 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 Don't make me choose. <laughs> Am I supposed to choose who? Wait, what is the question? Am I choosing who I think is attractive, or am I choosing which idea will work? What What is the choice? I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like it. Ah, fuck. No. No. I don't like it. Because this is implying... <sighs> Alright. Let's break it down for a moment. Okay. So... Ryan... Has nails for brains. And I really like Stephanie. I don't want to fuck it up with Stephanie. I really don't want to date Ryan at all. Ever. Period. The end. Plus what he did to my brother. But like, I think Steph going directly at it, it, it just... Ah. No, I, I... I don't like Ryan. I think he's an idiot. I, I don't like his actions. I don't like his words. I think he'd fuck this up. But assuming that she's gay is also not a good assumption. You don't want to go into it like that. But like, just, oh my god. These are both terrible ideas. These are both terrible ideas. And now I gotta side with one of them. Because if I don't side with the person I like, I don't get the brownie points I need to date the person I want. So now I have to do it to Steph. Final answer, Steph. Let's go with Steph. Badass DJ? It's a no-brainer. Sorry, Ryan. Fuck yes. In your face. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> Look, I appreciate the... the effort. But we don't even know if she has anything worth stealing yet. I'm just gonna try talking to her. Maybe I can get her worked up and read her emotions. I'll let you know if I need that distraction. Good luck. Oh boy. Your usual. Thanks, Alex. What are you doing? What's the best way to rile her up? Help me. Oh shit. Do I want to accuse her and get her pissed and then read her thoughts? Because then she might... Yeah, let's let's just go right at it. Fuck it. I know Typhon's responsible for my brother's death. I don't know how. And I don't know why yet. But I will find out. Alex, I can assure you that Typhon is committed to a full and open investigation. We want to find those responsible and hold them accountable just as much as you do. That's the truth. Hmm. I don't think I believe that. She's got a great poker face, unlike Mac. But let's see what she's really feeling. Let me try and read her first. Ooh, she's angry. I'm sick of the lies, and I'm sick of taking the heat for this company. Yep, that's what I she's thought. Pissed. If I can stoke her anger at Typhon, maybe I can find out more. Mm hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Hmm. Beer. Photo. Sticker? William Bloom, huh? Yeah. He's the best. Must be a, um, band she likes. Tyson Flyer. Drawing. Black Lantern. What does that say? Integrity. Oh, yes. Yes, ask about that. Integrity to our very core. What? Oh, yeah. That's our motto. It... It's a motto. Hmm. Integrity. Unless it gets in the way of profit, then fuck integrity. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Ask about the beer. Good beer? Yep. Cross? Do you belong to a church around here? Hmm? Oh, no. Honestly, I'm sort of lapsed with all that. I do miss it, though. Okay. Why would I ask for napkins? That's stupid. Is there anything else around here that's Typhon related? Let's ask about the photo. Is that your niece and nephew? They must be proud to have a super-powered businesswoman for an aunt. I suppose. They do look up to me. I try to be the best role model I can. Okay. Now I need to pick something that will push Diane's emotions over the edge. Gabe's plaque? Probably Gabe's plaque. Here we go. Look, I know you're not a bad person. But my brother is dead because of the choices you and Typhon made. How does that make you feel? I actually want to know. Mm. Alex, I... We... Typhon is doing everything we can to address the situation. That's the truth. Okay? Yeah, no, not okay. She's livid. Livid. All right. That's the emotion I was looking for. Time to explore Diane's anger about Typhon. Oh, there we go. Everything. Okay. Time to find out what Diane is really hiding. The phone. Does it fall within the tolerable limit? Well, as I say in the report, there's a small chance that debris from the detonation could... It's a simple question. It falls within the tolerable limits. Okay. Typhon brought me here, and look where it got me. Damn them all. So she hates them. Wait, there's something else. Oh, it's in her bag. There's a flash drive? Is there anything else first? No? Flash drive. I didn't join Typhon to cover up a murder. If they try to pin this on me, I'll have everything I need to fight back. Ah, she's protecting herself too. Holy shit. She must have evidence on the USB stick. Oh, looks like I'll need a distraction after all. All right, Steph, this is where you come in.
way to be so nonchalant about it. Like, she's just, like, staring over at the bar, like, <laughs> like, don't do that. Hey, Diane. Mm. Oh, hey, Steph. How are you? So, what's your deal? I'm sorry? Mm, coming down are too strong. Are you single? Semi-single? Taken, but still down to get drunk and make out? Oh, that is way too... Oh, Whoa. God. What? <laughs> no. I was not expecting that at all. Oh, Lord. <laughs> um, get it? Get it? No, not. Oh, embarrassed. Am I blushing? I feel like I'm blushing. Oh god. <laughs> Big time. Yeah. I could see your cheeks from space. <laughs> Super. Real good look for me. I'm so flattered. I don't even know what to say. Hey, no no sorry. Nice. Just think about it. Get nice. I'm not going anywhere. See ya. She's gonna notice. Maybe. Will she notice? Maybe not. Maybe she'll notice later. I'm nervous now. It's just... Mm, ugh. Dear Ward. <laughs> Holy shit, that was epic! Totally insane. insane! My heart is pounding. <laughs> Steph, there's a very real chance that you awoke something in Diane. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't be the first time. It's hilarious. You guys. Oh, that was hilarious. Oh my god. I hope this was worth it. Let's see what incriminating evidence is on this flash drive. Password protected. Guess I'm not surprised. Typhon? I'll bring this to Riley. See if she's willing to help. She's a whiz at computer stuff. In the meantime, we have a LARP to do. Mm-hmm. I forgot about that. Grab your hat and meet me at the park. And don't forget your guitar, okay? Okay. Really? Is the guitar really necessary? What? H how can you be a bard? Oh, that's right. A I'm a bard. The Never bard's mind. whole job is to musically regale people. Yeah, I need the bard. Okay. Well then, prepare to be regaled. I forgot I was a bard. So, did you finish the thing? Yeah, barely. It took me all night. I haven't carved like that in ages. All right. I need to grab my guitar and the hat that Steph got me. Okay. Hold on. Wow. Typhon officially clears Typhon of any wrongdoing in death of local man at the hands of Typhon explosions. What? Gunnison County Sheriff. The Sheriff's Department would like to provide a brief update regarding out ongoing... Is it our on ongoing investigation into the death of Gabe Chen? Mr. Chen's death has been officially ruled an accident. However, our investigation remains open and we encourage any members of the community who might have valuable information to step forward and share it with us. Our goal now is to gain a comprehensive understanding of the events that led to Mr. Chen's death in order to prevent further harm from befalling anyone in our community in the future. Thank you for your service, Deputy Pike. Oh yeah, of course Diane would fucking... If it was ruled an accident, why are you still investigating? As stated above, the goal at this point is to gather enough information to prevent an accident like this from occurring in the future. Accident. Scare quotes. <laughs> Yum, love to lick boots. Go back to your safe space. Please don't make me disable comments. Alright. Uh, regular business hours to give you in order to participate in Steph Gingrich's live action game. We'll see you all this evening. Have fun. Live action game. What? It's called a LARP, Dad. I knew that. I was testing you. Oh, God. 
Why did I just suddenly make the connection that Ryan is Jed's son? Why did I suddenly make that connection? I probably should have known this two chapters ago, but I just now suddenly realized that they're related. Fuck. I still don't like Ryan. I love Jed. I hate Ryan. Um, Liv Flowers. Good morning, Haven Springs. The famous rose card has been polished up and stocked with our finest. You can find it in the park at sundown. Pick one up and present it to your spring festival sweetheart. Ooh, I'm going to give one to Stephanie. Man, nobody's ever given me a rose at the Spring Festival. Don't worry, nobody's ever given Ryan one either. Har har, we'll see who's laughing tonight. Me at you. Yeah, probably. Dude, it's no fu fun picking on you if you're just going to admit defeat. LARP volunteers, some of you still haven't synced up with me about your characters. Cutting it a little close here, buds. Hit me up. To Stephanie. <laughs> I love Ducky. I've written an extensive backstory for my character, inspired in part by sections of Wu Cheng'en's Journey to the West. However, whenever I try to include it in this application, I receive an error message to the effect that I've exceeded the character limit. Thoughts? Well, I know what I'm doing with my afternoon. Can you drop off a copy at the shop? On my way. Reminder to all Haven residents, Typhon Mining will be setting off charges tonight at 5 Please ensure designated danger zones are clear, 24-hour safety line questions and concerns, which doesn't fucking work apparently, and please take note of our revised safety protocols, blah, 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 fuck you guys, and disabled replies. Best job I've ever had. Not that the competition is super fierce. Attention Black Lantern customers, the Black Lantern is happy to announce that we have returned to our normal hours of operation. We want to thank you all for patience and support during what has been a difficult time for many in our community. We look forward to seeing you all soon. On a happier note, we want to give Big Black Lantern welcome to Alex Chen, who has accepted a full-time waitstaff position with us. Be sure to show some love when you see her. Nice go, Alex. And then Riley sends a heart. Excellent news. I don't even know who that Alex person is. I don't remember. Hey all, I decided to close my portrait commissions for the time being. I need to work through my backlog. Sorry to disappoint. Take all the time you need. Nuts. Knew I shouldn't have put this this off. Last call for LARPers. For those who haven't heard, I'm planning a LARP live action role play for the afternoon of the Spring Festival and I'm in dire need of NPCs. If you ever wanted to try LARPing, this is a fun, low pressure way to get your feet wet. Come on by the record traders and let's talk details. To Stephanie, did I ever tell you that I starred in a science fiction film? I was fresh from Korea when the director, Mr. Julius Allen Silver, spotted me in a hardware store. He said, Mr. Have you considered being in pictures? Of course I had not, but th in those days I was eager to swallow every morsel on my plate so to speak so of course i agreed the film was to be called invaders from the mechanical planet i believe i still have a reel around here somewhere should you wish to organize a screening ducky i have genuinely never wanted anything more in my life i'm down i got plans for you kid uh oh <laughs> uh, so many memories of gabe i didn't get to make Thank you to everyone who attended the Gabe Chen Memorial Service and a special show of gratitude to those who spoke. I think we did Gabe proud. Do you remember that thing he used to do when he would get choked up but it was too embarrassed to admit it? I haven't cried since I was like 14. It's allergies. Don't look at me. I'm going to miss him a lot. Same. Yeah. Aw. Okay. So the rest is... Oops. I didn't want to go back that far. All right. We got text messages. Um, go back up. Let's see. Okay, guys, I'm making this official. Welcome to the Takedown Typhon thread. Fuck yeah. It's an honor and pleasure. Let's celebrate at Alex's place tonight. Shouldn't Alex make that proposal? Too late. Well, I guess I'm hosting then. You two are free for more scheming? Sounds good. I'm down. Crazy idea. Let's break into the Typhon office in Denver. Got it all figured out. I bet they have server access there. We can find evidence. Steph, we're not driving to Denver and breaking into a highly secure corporate office. Boo. But what if we did? Could I be the getaway driver? Sure. But Steph, your license is expired. How do you even know that? Because he's a big loser, a loser with a valid license? You guys are killing me. The plan is a go. Distract, distract. <laughs> Charlotte. Trying to go back to the top so I can read from the top. Uh, so I'm so sorry. Thank for saving. I'm so sorry. Thank you so much. Can you come by the dispensary? Your speech on the bridge was beautiful. Thank you for 
being there for us, of course. Diane stopped by with the affidavit again. I declined. I wish they would just drop it. I'm sorry, Char. Hang in there, okay? Hey, Alex, would you like to come over for dinner tonight? That sounds amazing. I'd love to. Can I bring anything? Just you? Maybe wine? See you tonight. Hey, again, I'm a little worn out. Any chance you could watch Ethan on Wednesday? Happy to. Can you pay me in more of those lemon bars you made from last week? For sure. Do you want the recipe? Nah, I'd much rather earn them by hanging out with Ethan than actually having to cook. Good deal. Hi, Alex. I'm so sorry, but I have to cancel our girls' night. I'm not feeling great. No problem. Need anything? I'm okay. Thanks, though. Shar, how many of the gummies is too many gummies? Oh, sweetie, try and relax. Can you tell me how many you had? Oh, yeah, the, the, the weed gummies. I forgot about those. I don't know why I made this note for weed gummies. I don't know what this means, but sure. Um, did you have anything else with them? Alcohol, other medication, just snacks. Take a nice deep breath. Take a drink of water and lie down on your side. Don't drive or do anything serious and it will pass. You had a little more than the normal dose, but nothing dangerous. Okay, thank you. Did I ever tell you I think you are so beautiful? Thank you. Just put your phone down and close your eyes. <laughs> hey, those texts last night were totally just a test. Did I pass? With flying colors. Ironically, flying colors are also what I see when I close my eyes today. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Mac. Okay. Thanks for the help, Chen. Just remember, I never told you anything. I risked more than just my job to talk to you. I hear you, Mac. Don't worry. Get some sleep. Easier said than done. Ryan, um, let's see, Alex, I'm so sorry I should have saved him, I don't know what to say, hey, that was terrible, you shouldn't have had to see that, I know you're going through a lot, but can we talk, I know it's asking a lot, but I think I really need to talk to you, thanks again for everything today, I'm glad I could help, do you want to meet tonight and plan for our next, plan what's next for our super sleuthing, absolutely, just tell me where and when, happy face. Hey, you need a break from all the late night research. Want to go mountain biking Saturday? Hurtling over dangerous terrain? So relaxing. You'll have fun, I promise. Okay, I'll, I'll try. Don't worry, we can replace the front wheel. My ass still hurts. LOL. <laughs> you handle it like a champ. Short notice, but tonight is my annual viewing of this amazing nature documentary if you want to join. Oh god, that's so lame. No. Amazingly, Steph is busy for the third year in a row. I'm detecting a pattern here. Hmm, is there... A stuffy British dude narrating? The stuffiest. Right answer. I'm in. Steph. Um, <laughs> Let's see. Swing by the store. Nothing big. Thank you so much. I think Ethan's going to love it. Hey, don't think you're done playing foosball with me. The rivalry continues. I need a chance to redeem myself after that awful performance. I'm sorry, that championship was final. What? JK. Oh, you bitch. LOL. I was devastated. I'd love to keep playing. Come over tonight? Sick. Alex, I'm gonna start running a tunnels and chambers game this week if you want to join. Hey, I have no idea what that involves. Sitting around with snacks, role-playing a cool story, pretending to kill stuff, I'm summarizing. Is it okay if I'm terrible? One, you won't be terrible. Two, sit in on our first session. We can play it by ear. Rad. You free tonight? Ryan and I are meeting up and wanted to fill you in on some of the digging we're doing on Typhon. Hell yeah, I'd love to help. Yo, sup. What do you think about bringing that guitar over to the record store and jamming a bit? Like, in front of other living human beings? Just this living human being. I haven't played in front of other people in recent memory. I may be particular about a lot of things, but in this case, I am a judgment-free zone. What the hell? Let's go for it. What time? Anytime tonight, I'm here. I think I need another jam session tonight. What you say? I say yay. Yes, I have some ideas. Oh, dear. No, oh, dear. I promise. By the way, you're genuinely great. You have a gorgeous voice. Oh, honey, I love you. Thank you. That's way too kind. Maybe a downright lie. Nah. And then Riley. Uh, <laughs> uh, hi, how have you been holding up? Hey, Riley, I'm doing pretty okay, actually. Thanks. How are you? Good. Drowning in flowers. Please send help. LOL. Okay, random question. Random answer. Are you Princess Shushu 2539? Oh my god, how? LOL. No, really, how? You showed me Shushu when I visited, remember? And 2539 is Alex on a phone keypad. Wow, she's smart. I've been had. Ha ha ha. 
So you play Dust in Daylight didn't take you for a JRPG girl. Yeah, me neither. I found it here and thought I'd give it a shot. Now I can't get enough. I thought I was playing single player only. You must have spirit guides turned on because I could see you wandering around the Port of Clouds. Ah, that's so cool. Can we play sometime? I'm stuck on the big scorpion boss. I'd love to. Hey girl, thanks for the drink last night. Great to just unwind with you. You got it. Let's do it again. Sweet. And then our journal. Oh yeah, Diane. Anger. Diane's guilt was fractured, stranded in the no man's land between sadness and fury, a place I couldn't reach. I had to nail it down in one place or the other where I could wrap my fingers around it. I used my own anger to draw hers out, stoked it, cultivated it. She was all but shaking with it, at Typhon, sure, and the position they placed her in. But more than anything, I think, at herself. If I'm honest, I'm not sure how I feel about using this ability that way, forcing someone into emotional corner just to read them. But Typhon has us in a corner too, don't they? I keep thinking that she could have used that anger, turned it into something constructive, used it to bring these fuckers down and stop them from hurting anyone else. But she didn't, did she? She turtled up, collected ammo to keep Typhon from coming for her. Fuck anyone else who happens to come across them in the meantime, right? Whatever. I have what I need. Typhon brought me here. Fuck integrity. I didn't join Typhon to cover up a murder within the tolerable limits. Tell me more about the tolerable limits. Tell me more about integrity. Tell me what you sing as you bury the bones. It goes, a target on your head keeps their sights off me. And then these are the memories that we've collected or found. Okay, so I have to find the bard hat and pick up the guitar, and I think everything else is good. There's a chipmunk here. Where did this come from? Ducky said this would help me feel at home. Oh, look at it! I'll have to take his word for it. Oh, this is so freaking cute! Thank you, Ducky! That's adorbs! Oh, there's a lap- oh, we have a laptop? I found some really cute photos of Gabe and Ethan on this thing. Is that his laptop? Maybe it's his laptop. Steph bought this for me as a gag, but I kind of developed a taste for it. Oh, the kiwi schnapps that we tried. I don't even know if I'm doing this right, but it felt like I had to do something. The photo. Life in Haven would be a lot worse without these two weirdos. Nice. Ooh, there's a chest. I feel like I kept the hat in here. Only one. Only one way to find out. Is it in there? Yes. Huh. There it is. Yep. Ooh, there's feather boa. Yeah. I don't need to know what that was for. <laughs> Another one of Gabe's hidden cans. Dork. Half person, half dump truck. What's the key for? I feel you. Oh, hi there. Now what do you unlock? We're gonna find out. Um. Take the bard hat. Oh shit. The hmm. feather on the hat must have fallen off. Maybe I can find it. Just use some off the boa. Oh. Gabe's last effects from the coroner. Pike dropped it off a few days ago. Oh, so they did find his body. Yes, I've been avoiding looking through it. Oh no. Okay. <sighs> Damn. You can take the kid out of juvie. Hmm keys. Oh. If you're hot, hurry up and finish your shift, love shark. God damn it. I'm not giving up yet, Gabe. I better find that feather. Steph is a stickler for details. We have a gnome! A housewarming gift from Eleanor. She said Gabe loved these little dudes. No sunglasses, though. We're one step closer now. Totally not corporate sabotage to-do list. Okay, if you're trying to be secretive about it, maybe don't write it and post it on your refrigerator. Like... Ah... Uh... 
figure out Diane's deal, maybe read her. Alex working on it. Turns out corporate law is complicated. All three dudes gave a crazy high price pass. Research other Typhon sites in U.S. abroad. Spy on miners in the Black Lantern. Do you want me to get fired? No. Couldn't figure out dark web. Done, 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 and loved it. Request copy of completed police report. How does Haven feel about Typhon radio poll? Oh my god. Don't be that obvious, guys. It's just not good. What's this? No. Steph, I will murder you. Alex, Steph told me you'd be willing to play at our next open mic night. I'd wager it'd really help loosen folks up and break the ice. Can you make it? Ooh, so we'll have to perform. Gummies. Wish I'd taken Steph's advice. Ugh. Alex, thanks for the foosball game. I mean it. Also, only eat one of these at a time. Apparently, I had too many. Shocker. Okay, I'm not picking up the guitar yet. First, we're going... Ooh, is this drawer? I can unlock this drawer. What's in the drawer? Distractions. Also, I have to change my outfit because I need to wear something cat. This must have been Gabe's. Make shit right list. Find Alex. Find owner of stolen Chevy. Reimburse Jed for free rent. Return Ernesto's Walkman. Donate to Lauren's detention center. Apologize to Vic. New bong for Kevin. Apologize to Zoe. Really apologize to Katya this time. Apologize to Ira and tell him you like his remixes. That's a long list. And I bet he would have gotten through it. Apologize to Oscar. Pay Mr. Walbeck for the Chevy. Apologize to that guy from the mall. Write thank you letter to Lenny. Mail check to Mrs. Franks for the broken window. She moved to Maryland? Track her down. Write to Miss Henry at Bookman High and tell her she was right. Forgive Dad. Wow. Oh, wait. I didn't... There was another page. Fuck. Pick it back up. There was another page. No. Bring it back. Wow, Gabe. Oh, there wasn't. Okay, never mind. I got scared. Wow. Steph is a rock star for putting this together. Ethan is gonna flip. A day in the kingdom of Collins? Wait. Of Collins, yeah. Welcome, travelers. Today, Feanor the Monster Slayer visits the troubled Stoneborn, capital city of Collins. Can he dispatch the ravenous monster horde and save the kingdom? LARP Basics. A LARP, live action role playing, is a game in which players portray their characters through physical action, using costumes and props to add to the fun. Safety rules, we're here to have fun, don't hit too hard, go for arms, legs, torso, back, sides, front, avoid hands, feet, neck, head, act stuff out. If you get hit, perform a grunt or injury. Thank you for, thank you so much for doing this, it means a lot, Steph. Your character is Alwyn, half elf, bard, level one, health points 10, attacks, effect, one damage, magic, effect, plus one health to you and your allies, doubles Thanor's next attack. After the harrowing attack on the Song Songvery Amphitheater, Alwyn the Bard has been a constant companion to Thanor the Monster Slayer. The two have endured many trials and have recently found themselves answering a call for heroes in the city of Stoneborn. Thanor. Human warrior, level 1, health points 10. Attacks, effect 2 damage. One damage plus one fire damage over next two turns. Magic. Effect. Protects Thanor from next attack. Thanor the Monster Slayer is the most famous hero of the Adderway Peninsula. Even the smallest child knows he once felled a valley bear with empty hands and hurled a spear into the breast of a wraith mid-flight. Entire cities have been saved from the scourges of darkness thanks to Thanor's unrivaled strength. Ooh, look at that. She turned the whole town into a um, map for Stoneborn. That's pretty freaking cool. I like, I like. Okay, let's change for real. Get dressed. Time to put on some kitty clothes. Hell yeah. Appropriate. 
A dire rat joined your party. <laughs> shoo shoo. Okay. I thought she was going to talk longer on that, which is why I drank, but you know, things. Leave it to me to wreck Gabe's bike on my first ride. At least Ryan had a good laugh about it. Is there anything around here that I can feel? Some hidden memories. Let's open this and see what's inside. Also, I love this shirt and I want it in real life. Nothing in here. Okay. Just want to make sure I'm not missing stuff. Anything here? Anything here? Nothing here. Okay. More notes? Or same notes? One day, I'll stop being a freeloader. For now, I'm just grateful. Alex, I appreciate your offer to start paying rent. Take a few months to fill your piggy bank first, then we can talk, Jed. Aw. Thank you, Jed. You're so kind. Let's go outside. There we go real quick before we get too invested and see what's upstairs which is like the the rooftop thing yeah let's take a look out here see what we can find so pretty although the plants are dying because it's probably getting like late spring or fall wait where are we or are we just not caring for them Probably got to do something about that. Yikes. This garden is looking gnarly. Mm-hmm. Let's see what we got up here. Look at the plants. Let's weed the plants. Take care of them. Like, I know I gotta go to a LARP, but I'm gonna weed first. It's only gonna take, like, ten seconds, but, you know. Uh, looks better. Cute bird! Look, man. If you want to live here, you need to do your own dishes. <laughs> okay. Weed those. Make it look pretty. A lot of responsibility goes to having your own place, whether it's a small apartment or house. You need to take care of stuff. I often find when it comes to like gardens and stuff that I have like a good starting point and then I just usually fall out with it. I haven't played for anyone else in years. That was a good night. Couldn't I just clean that up, though? I wonder how many times Gabe got stoned up here and stared at these. Guessing it was more than zero. Hm. Is there anything else here? So far, Ryan is the only one that uses this. Maybe I should just gift it to him. Yeah, you could do that. Ugh. Not much better. We gotta water it. Also, we gotta pick up the things. You can't just leave them there. Well, it's better than nothing. Where's the hose? Wasn't there a hose that they just showed somewhere? I swear to God I saw a hose in the distance. Oh, right here. Can I do anything with this? No? Why not? Can't we this? Like, what the frick? Why can I only half do things? Alright, well. Right, the beginning of that letter. I appreciate your offer to start paying rent. I wish people did that with me. Like, I appreciate your offer to start paying your student loans. Like, just, just fill up your piggy bank before we hit you. Wouldn't that be heavenly? I think I have checked everything else here now. 
I think we can just oh oh that's just gonna yeah we can't we can't do that let's take the guitar I will be Alex the cat bard fuck yeah Alex the cat bard saving the day here I come No? Why can't I suddenly... What? I can still get dressed. I don't want to. What else do I need? Oh! Ah! The, the feather! That's right. Put that feather in my cap and call it macaroni. Okay. I better find Ethan right away. Okay, I must have texted. SOS, not sure LARP is happening. Ethan's not into it. Shit, sounds like his dad is picking him up in a few hours, too. Fuck my life. Any ideas? Let me try talking to him. Be right there. Hero. Alright, so now I gotta go. Alex the Bard, ready to serve time to head out <laughs> now I gotta find Ethan somewhere why don't we ever get prompted to feed the fish I feel like that poor fish is dying on our dresser we never get prompted to feed him like those beta fish have to be fed like when we had a beta fish you had to feed them like a little bit every day and they're so specific unless that plant is something they can eat but I'm not sure Never had a plant in mind when I owned one. I want that shirt. Hey. I don't need, like, cheering up or whatever. Okay. So... Maybe this wasn't the most subtle idea, but... Mm. All of these are terrible answers. Uh... Do you for Gabe? Gabe was so excited to LARP with you. I bet he'd really want you to do it. I do want to do this. It's just... Uh-oh. Kid doesn't like expressing his feelings. Typical. He's, he's that age. Everyone's been working so hard. And if I'm not happy, they'll all be disappointed. That's not true. You're allowed to feel, kid. Your kid! Feel it! Grieve! Must be weird having a bunch of adults pressuring you to dress up in a costume and act like you're having fun. Yeah! Especially my mom! She always looks so. <sighs> sad. Cause I'm like bummed out. But I can't just pretend. Then don't. So, don't pretend. Just be yourself. The glare? Or oh my God. yourself with a foam sword and a funny hat. But what if I'm still, you know, not having fun? Life isn't all about having fun, dude. And don't. That's fine, too. No one will be disappointed in you for being you. All right. But I don't want to do it alone. You have to help me. Of course. I dressed up, didn't I? <laughs> you think I just walk around like this and I go home and take a nap? Come on, kid. Let's be real. Oh, 
Oh boy, look at it. Thanor, the monster slayer. Thanks to the gods and all the heavens you've come. Nice. I am in desperate need of a great hero. Could you be the one? Please tell me of your exploits. Oh, this is cute. Uh, there's a bunch of stuff. Maybe my bard can sing something about me. Ah, oh. great. Sure. Uh, horde of ogres. Ooh, kraken. A kraken ate a city every year until it died on Thanor's spear. My goodness. So you must be Thanor's bard, Alwyn, whose songs have magical powers. Aww. It sounds like you are exactly the heroes I need. My name is King Tabor. The age of monsters has come upon my kingdom. Horrible creatures stalk the streets. My people live in constant fear. But there's hope. An ancient prophecy describes three mysterious gems known as soul jewels that can save us all. I need you to go search the kingdom. Survive whatever's out there and bring me back those jewels. Do you understand? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Good. Then you must go now. My people are counting on you. I love this 100%. Should we start with the main road? Okay. Time to find some jewels. Ah! I love it! Uh, we are open. We know a lot of you have floral needs in the ramp up to Spring Festival, so despite the event on Main Street, we'll be maintaining business hours until 5. Attention, monster hunters! This appears to be the result of some sort of extra-dimensional rift opening up and spilling another universe's florist into our world. The Magpie Emporium will investigate. I'm glad you're having fun, honey. <laughs> The Magpie Emporium arrived in the night, transforming an empty storefront into a fully stocked magic supply shop. Mortal residents are encouraged to come by and peruse our wares. Nice. So I gotta find the Soul Amethyst, the Soul Sapphire, and the Soul Ruby. So purple, blue, and red? Because Amethyst is purple. Sapphire... Is sapphire blue or green? Sapphire, I think maybe green. Purple, green, red, purple, blue, red, something. So sapphire is blue, you're okay. you're seriously Alwyn? Yes. Don't you recognize me? Oh, yeah, of course. Um, it's... Okay, so, yes, these are... It's been a long time since Carneris. Exactly. Those were good times, huh? Except for the spiders. Yeah. <laughs> Are you LARPing? Looking cool. Oh, you're just a park man. All right. Um, how do I get out of here? Down here. Okay. <laughs> Ryan's a wolf. Okay. It's a wolf. A dire wolf. Shit, what do we do? I think we have to fight it. Oh my god, is it gonna be an act? This is so cool! Yes! Ethan. Um, attack. Use... A stab? <clears throat> Amazing! Oh my god. So, Alex. Magic. Stirring him. Stirring him! Double Thanor's next attack. Nice. Two damage. Oh, okay. So, Ethan. Attack. Use a burning blade? Burning blade! Two damage, <clears throat> and you're on fire for the next two turns. Nice. 
Alex, magic. Um, no wait, back. Attack. Untuned cord. Untuned cord. <laughs> One damage. This is so adorable. I love it. He's dead. Yeah. Screw you, Ryan. One damage to allies? Better be nice to Thanor. <gasps> New skill acquired! Class warrior, skill fire blast type magic, effect three damage to enemies, plus one damage to allies, may be used once per battle only. Oh, I love Let's it. Keep going. I love like the adorable like oh <laughs> and then it just what drops do you think shit. This key is for? Maybe it unlocks something in one of these stores. He's happy. This is actually really fun. I know, right? Alright. Uh, dire Wolf. Awu. <laughs> Hiss. Amazing. How do we know for sure it's dead? Should we tickle it? Stop it. Be serious. Okay. Alright, time to... Ooh, that's a cool face. Where do we go? This way? Is there anything this way? Let's go to the peach. There's a scroll. Hmm. Scroll of healing restores you and your allies to full health, removes all negative status effects, poison stun, etc. May be only used once. Awesome. What is that? It's a magic scroll we can use in fights. Who do we have here? Thane or the Monster Slayer. And my bard. And what you up to, Thane or? Saving your lives. There's monsters out there. Orcs and minotaurs and such. Be careful. Yeah. Sounds dangerous. It is. You're gonna die. What about a dragon with a... No, I don't want to hear your bullshit thing. Aren't I supposed to be the one teaching you how to throw? Hey, hey, what's all this? Too busy to talk right now. Looks like the Black Lantern is part of the LARP. What does that say? Oh man, they have blood here? Wait, what? What is this? Ooh. It just pisses me off so bad, you know? The way this world is designed to make you into a horrible person. An appointment reminder. That's just the price we pay for safety and security, I guess. Ooh. Is it? Are you sure? Oh, God, she's getting therapy. Of course. That's how it works. You sharpen your teeth or you starve. Hmm. I would gladly work at a place called Gullweather's Tavern. Amazing. They hung up a new thing. Diane's trying so hard to be a ruthless monster that she just might become one. Blood. Whoa. What's that about? It's blood. Let's enter. Wanna look in here? Yeah. Let's go in. How did we leave? Because our apartment's above this building. How did we leave and not notice, like, the bleh, unless it happened after we left? Yeah, Jed does look like he's wearing a Burger King crown. I just read that. <laughs> oh, no. There's fruit on the floor. Oh, there's a arm and what happened here? Whoa, Ducky! Oh, survivors, I see. He's a gnome. <laughs> I love this. Oh, it's so. I want to hug him. <gasps> Are you hurt? <laughs> Hardly my first monster attack. Oh my god! I know an escape trick or two. 
Do you know what this key is for? Belong to Barry, the tavern keeper. That's his leg over there. Oh, God. Oh. So, if you want to try all of the locks, I'm sure he won't stop you. Amazing. I love, Let's I see love what him. Find around here. I love him. I'm a genius for convincing Steph that my character should be alone behind the bar. All the drinks I want. Hmm. Not sure how I feel about that. I love him. Okay. I think I checked all the compartments. Oh, hold on. I don't want to yes? talk to you yet. How'd you survive? How did you survive the attack? Well, I'm not proud of it, but I tripped an elderly woman. She had it coming. Stingy dish wench. <laughs> you've poured yourself some ale <gasps> oh my god uh. oh I love you You're, you get it on the house you just survived a monster attack I think you deserve a couple drinks on the house truly wise beyond your years you deserve it I love you get drunk my dude have fun Want to tell him about our quest? We're on a quest to end the age of monsters. So you won't have to live in fear anymore. Are you now? Let me give you something that you may find useful. A bell. Thanks. I'm going to go ahead and guess we'll be meeting a snake. A Phidian chime instrument requires bard. Effect snakes within hearing must fall asleep. Okay. I'm going to remember what any of these do. We're going to keep looking around. Good luck. Who are we talking to? What's dialogue unlocked? I don't know. I actually feel bad for that person. If there was a monster and you only had your guitar, would you smash their head with it? Be honest. Yes. Of course I would. Are you sure? Yes. I'll believe it when I see it. Because if I smash it, then I don't have to play. <laughs> House Bard. Sorry, Steph. Alwyn is pretty happy with her current gig. House Bard wanted. Seeking a House Bard to entertain at dinner stances, beheadings, etc. Must be witty, perceptive, generous of heart, black hair preferred, cute smile, a plus excellent compensation. Old swords for sale. See Elwyn the blacksmith. Or Ewen? Ewen? Repel monsters with this secret blend of herbs. Only four gold coins for the recipe. Meet behind Gullweather's Mondays at midnight. Anyone else been hearing spooky sounds around the castle? Yes? No. <laughs> love it. I love it. I found a coin! Heck yeah, money. Money mine. Money, 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 money. Sheet music. Yes, I shall play. Finding what all the stuff. To the rest of the music? New skill acquired. Bard. Hypnotic. Fugue. 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 Something. Gonna have to find more. What's back here? Oop! There's a wanted poster. Who's wanted? This kingdom has serious problems. Lord Cravius, Batrica, uh, Sir Howell of Graveton, and Gorum Dankbreath. Hell yeah. The 13th Quinquennial Meeting of the Daegu Biscuit Boys is hereby called to order. 
I'm sorry to announce that all six of us remain upright and above uh, ground. Uh, first point of order. Ducky, if you had to guess, though, about how much longer you fixing to live? Just long enough to collect, Gordon. And not a minute longer. Oh. I'll crawl graveward with your shares clutched in my stiffening fingers. You mark my words. Ducky is in a tontine. I don't know what that means or what it is. Can someone explain that? Ooh, that better be washable. Yeah, I hope so. I was gonna say there's blood on that. The amount of detail in this LARP is insane. The Legend of the Soul Jewels. Belrin Nira Desis. Long ago, it is said, when unspeakable terrors reigned even in daylight, four heroes faced the great shadow on the Kelian shores. For days, the battle raged until the powers of the great shadow overwhelmed the four heroes, pushing them to the brink of death. There, among waves stained with blood, three of the heroes gave their lives, calling upon an ancient spell that pulled the souls from their bodies and fashioned them into three stones of immeasurable power. From Nira the Berserker, strong of the four came the soul ruby from desi's the cleric weaver of stories came the soul sapphire from belin the illusionist keeper of the old books came the soul amethyst with these three soul jewels in hand the fourth hero took up their sword and struck down the great shadow piercing it with light then weary and bloodied from battle the fourth hero hid the jewels away and wandered into the deep wilds of rune never to be seen again Love it. So it is purple, red, blue. Okay. What is this? Steph thought of everything. She's amazing at this. Ooh, there's a letter there. Letter, 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 letter. Guess Lawrence is going to need a new business advisor. <laughs> Dear Lawrence, I write to amend the advice I gave you when we last dined together. There is no need to sell your business. I am confident the Age of Monsters will soon come to an end. I have it on good authority that His Majesty's call for heroes was answered by none other than Thanor, the legendary monster sl- And then he died. Oops. <laughs> Let's just take a break and just play a game. No, we won't do that. Is there anything else back here that I can feel? What is that noise? Is it this? Or is it just... Ooh. It's a weird noise. Can't feel him. What's this about? Someone knows how to keep Thanor busy. Yes. So let's... Ooh, the bloody leg. Ugh. Rough day for Barry the Tavern Keeper. Let's unlock this music box. Ooh, it's pretty. I want it in real life. Look at that. Thanor. Did you see this? That's got to be it. Put that key in, in there. Open it up. Let's see what we got. Ooh. It's one of the jewels. Nice. We got the amethyst. Okay, take the music box. It's super cool. No? Great. I'll keep it. I'm just gonna go drop it off in my bedroom. Two to go. That wasn't so bad, right? Now I feel more confident we can find the others. Glad you finally believe in us. <laughs> That's not what I meant. I've I've been believing. So gorgeous. Yeah. Where does Steph get all this stuff? Date her. Keep her things. I actually feel bad for that person. Okay. All right, let's... Oh, there's... What's this? What's this? What's this? Steph really went all out in here. She did. It's really cool, though. Jukeboxes. Shut off. Warning. We're going to have to deal with this, aren't we? Take heed! It is believed that a swamp troll has taken residence below the eastern bridge. Use extreme caution when crossing. Or better yet, don't. Did you see this warning? Yeah. Is he still happy? I dare say. Alex is my favorite employee. Ducky's yes. affection. So easily bought. 
I'll take it. I love Ducky. He's the best. I will take it. Bye. Godspeed. Oh, I thought he was saying bye to me. <laughs> He's just like, bye! <laughs> oh, God. Ducky being a gnome just makes my day. It's just beautiful and so pure, and we need more of him in the world. I want real-life duckies everywhere for everybody. Check out what I found in that chest. Scroll of nimbleness. Plus one dodge. You and your allies will dodge the next attack. May it only be used once. Nice work, Thanor. Oh, got a phone text. Can someone please explain why everyone on Main Street is dressed like a Renaissance festival threw up on them? The Age of Monsters hath descended upon our fair Hamlet. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Listen not, sir, for, to those who would tell you to abandon hope, for the great hero Thanor has arrived at our gates. What does this mean? I just want to get some ice cream. Awoo. Ryan, is that you? People so confused. Riley. I should probably drop in on Riley and thank her in person. Um. Hey, I made Ryan tell me what this USB is for. He was being vague for my own protection. Oh, don't worry. I'm going to try my best to get you access. Oh my God. No guarantees. Depends on how good the password is. Thank you so much for even trying. We weren't sure if you would. Well, you deserve the truth. Typhon's obviously hiding something. Mac's still scared to death of them. Anyway, I'll be at the shop if you need anything. I really, really appreciate it. Okay. So... There was some really interesting stuff in there. Ooh, there's a jester! Now you look pale. I told you so. I can't... Oh, yes, I can. I can't remember the last time I had this much fun. I don't even that know who you makes are. makes two of us. But we're gonna... Riddle! Hey, let's hear your riddle. There are three, it is said. Heroes long dead. Fashioned into soul jewels. Blue, violet, red. What are their names? Do not be misled. Oh! We read about that in the tavern, right? Tell him! Oh god. Uh... Their names are... Nero, Desi's Bellin. The answer is Nira, Desis, and Bellin. Oh, Desis. You solved the riddle, you've been told. Your prize? A useful hint. Behold. To bribe that deadly troll of old, you have to pay four coins of gold. Oh, so to cross the bridge we need money. Four coins. Got it. Okay. Uh, there's more. Because you solved my verse, you may take one gold from my purse. Nice. I wish we could go back to the tavern when it's full of people. It was full of people. Alive people. <laughs> Obviously. Does he... Can we hear another riddle? Oh, uh, shit. Sorry. I only had one prepared. This guy's a fraud, I have declared. Alright. Not bad, Thanor. Let's let's take our coin. Thanks. So we need one more coin. Is there anything else around here? Making sure don't miss anything. Okay. I think we're good. So I'm trying to also look for things. There's a guy here. I don't know if he's part Go of anything. Meet them. He's just Benchman. Thanor. Okay. Go get him. Thanor. Is this guy never not on his phone? Hey, Ooh, there's kid. a scroll. You responsible for that massacre in the Black Lantern? Scroll of advantage. You and your allies gain an extra turn. May only be used once. Found a scroll? Yeah. Okay. 
Finding all the cool shit around here. There's a sign on here? Oh, that's just the take heed. Okay. Skiing bike. I don't think we were ever in there before. Treasures of Tibet. We weren't there before. Could there be something down the alley? Could be. I'm just looking for scrolls and stuff. Oh, there's a guy with an axe. He's LARPing. No one appreciates me. Oh, there. He's a blacksmith. Like adventuring folk. Hold on. Oh, what a thankless life. Being a smith in the age of monsters. Oh. Whoa. He's really into this. Well, let's be really into this then. Everything okay? You seem pretty, um, grumpy. I've forgotten the damn components of sun silver. Don't suppose you know the composition? Hmm. Um, if we find out, we'll tell you. I won't hold my breath. Okay, so we have to find that. And then there's a magpie emporium. I'm guessing this is a fancy art gallery. Wait, no, a pet shop. Oh, let us enter. Go for it. Monster or mortal? Mm. Mortal. Come in. Here we go. 